Wait here till I return. When did you last see the Elderman? Leave us be. It is not your place to be asking such questions. Can your guard speak through you, Hedavrid? Can he tell me where the Elderman is? Our lord is not a trained dog who speaks on command. My goodness. Hunvald's father was recuperating here not long ago. Someone may have seen him depart. Check that hay. Ah, better stay alert. What? Worms, take it! Are you the head sister here? Aye. And I'm not too comforted by the sight of you wielding weapons like a war chief. We're a hospice, not a barracks. It's bad enough I've got these armored cod pieces watching me work. Now you! No harm will come to you or those you care for. I'm only looking for your elderman. I'd be risking my neck telling you anything. And if my head rolls, these sick and ailing folk will follow me to the grave. Your elderman would agree. So the sooner I find him, the more quickly these prowling guards will leave your hospice. That's a pleasant thought. Our lord was in a bad way here, and getting worse, in spite of our efforts. Then, quite against my instruction, some guards moved him out. I overheard them talking about a bathhouse. There's no working bathhouse in Lincoln. So, I gather they meant the old ruins just south of here, by the eastern walls. Ruins, just south of here. I'll look there. Thank you. I pray you find him. He's in desperate need of care. Wise to let those Mercians nobles use our tunnels, if you ask me. What choice do we have? At least this way they'll leave us be. They killed one of their own. What's to stop them from splitting our skulls as well? Because they fear us, see? No one takes us for fools. You got it.
See, these tunnels run deep. Was the ultimate fleeing to a hideaway beneath Lincoln? Guards here are vigilant.
fighting here? About what? A violent struggle between nobles and bandits. Bandits didn't fare so well. A noble's cloak with the image of a swan. Looks like the ultimate passed this way. Saxon nobleman paid some bandits for permission to sneak through these tunnels on their way to Bolingbroke Castle. Mercian nobles made a deal with some bandits, paid them hush money to let them sneak through these caves. When the time came, the bandits ambushed the nobles. But it didn't end well for the bandits. In the struggle, the elderman's cloak was torn off. But he got away and headed east for Bolingbroke Castle. That's my best lead. will attack on sight here. Come no closer.
into the keep now. Is it all gold and silver up there? Hide down, lad. Keep your nose out of that. It's not a topic you need knowing about.
What's all that then? on the right track. That keep is well protected. There now, my lord. All is prepared. Shall we begin the washing? Hey, who comes? Welcome, stranger. Are you here to pay tribute to our lord, Elderman? This biscuit has been dry for some time, sister. How long has the Elderman been dead? Dead is such a drastic word. 
I like to think of my lord as transformed. That's not untrue. Have you need of anything? Humboldt deserves to know the truth about his father's fate. He is owed an inheritance, and deserves a chance to become Elderman himself. All in good time, I imagine. No, now. When the guards put him in my care, I was told to keep all this a secret. Until the appointed time. When I asked who gave these orders, they struck me. I wish I could say more. I've seen all I need to, but Hunball will need proof. Of course. You're welcome to search through his effects, though I'm not sure what trinket would best serve your purpose. I'll find something. I don't know what this is, and I'd rather not ask. Yes, I thought the same. Troubling. Dried herbs and berries, crushed into powder. The time between my lord's departure and his burial is... longer than usual. My lord must keep up appearances for his upcoming rites. A box of musty clothing, and a brooch with a crest. The house of the ferocious swan. This will do. I'll return this brooch to Humboldt and Lincoln. I hope the poor boy can withstand such ill news. Take care. And you. I shall take you to your family crypt at Nettleham within Lincoln. There, you may lay beside your forebearers, the great and glorious kings of old Lindsay. Please. Do not desecrate our lord. I'm a Dane, not a cruel grief monger. Foul rat droppings everywhere. Even in death, my lord is a friend to all of God's creatures. Best raise my hand here. What news? Your father's dead. Wait, what? The sigil of Humbiot's house. I found it near his body. No. No, this cannot be. He was strong. A pillar of Lincolnshire. He cannot be gone. He... He... <laughs> Oh, you poor boy. 
I'm so, so sorry. I am a man, Archer! Do you hear me? I am a man and I am my father's son! Do not forget it! Keep steady, Hunwald. You're now the head of your house. Another swan takes flight. Only I remain, last in a line of dwindling nobles. I'm sorry, Hunwald. I had already asked a priest to administer last rites when your father disappeared. What? I didn't tell you sooner because I... I thought by some miracle he had survived. You lied to me! You silly, sobbing mooncalf. Will you never grow up? Lord have mercy on that woman. She should have said something. It was her duty to say something. Hunwald was the son of an elderman. Will he take his father's seat? The title is not hereditary, but he can plead his case before a shire moot. King Cheowulf must then ratify the decision. Explain how this works, your shire moot. A moot is a meeting of lords. We convene from time to time to steer the course of our shire. It was always my intention to convene a moot. But between our troubles in Lincoln and the bandits' raids, we slipped into a pattern of convenience. We have a similar custom, what we call an Althing. An assembly of good folk. With so many like habits, there should be peace between our people and yours. Perhaps that begins now. Apart from Hunwald, who else will stand for the ultimate seat? If I may be so bold, I should like to put my name forward. Under my care, this Shire has found some peace this past month. I will offer my name as well. My family has ancient ties to this land. And I am proud to say I have forged quite a friendship with the Danes to the north. Good. My priests will spread word of the moot across the Shire and will convene in a few days' time. Uh, do visit my estate, Eivor. I have something for you. Something I think you'll enjoy. I'll find the time. Eivor, a word if you don't mind. Is the word Christ or pagan? Oh, I deeply regret my churlish ways when we first met. I did not treat you as my god commands. With kindness and love. Love is a difficult feeling to command. Yes. Quite. In any case, thank you for putting this mystery to rest. I do hope we'll see you at the moot. With Hundiolf's death an open secret, Hunwald's enemies may strike again. I should find him before they do. Archer went to console.